What's going on there guys? My name is Sermon we're playing a game of Mafia 2. Now basically guys, uh, the game here, I'm sorry, but I have to fix the volume of my game real quick because it's a tad bit loud. And this is the first time of me playing Mafia 2. So uh, we're gonna we set the we're gonna set the cut the brightness to that brightness to four so I can actually see the game properly. And then we're gonna go to apply and then yeah. excuse me. Let's play the story. Uh, we'll do I'm not familiar with the game, but I'm gonna try to do it without having to um make it easy. So hopefully I can play it. Let's hope. 2K games. <sighs> Mafia 2. My name is Vito Scaletta. I was born in Sicily in 1925. That little guy's me. I'm standing there with my parents and my sister Francesca in front of our old house. I don't really remember too much about the old country, except that we were pretty hard up. And then one day my father decided it was time to move away. from Sicily, across the ocean, to start a new life in America. Never in my life had I seen anything as fantastic as Empire Bay. It was beautiful. On the other hand, I'd never seen anything filthier, more disgusting than our new shithole of an apartment. <laughs> the American dream. It was more like a nightmare. My father started working at the port for the guy who arranged our immigration. It was backbreaking work, and what little money he made mostly went towards booze. Eventually, my parents sent me to school. I had to learn English. I sure as hell wasn't going to do that in a neighborhood full of Italians. That's where I met Joe. Come on, Vito, hurry it up. We ain't got all night. Over time, Joe and I got to be best friends. And since we were both poor and there wasn't much work around, shit, we started a little business of our own. Freeze! Police! Stop! Uh-oh. Vito, this way! Throw me to bed! Stop! Run the shoot! Shit. Okay, you bastard. Spread your legs. Fuck. And put your hands on the bed. I'm sorry. Well, that one time it didn't work out so good. The year was 1943. America was at war. And the army was looking for guys who spoke the language to help with the invasion of Sicily. I was 18. And anything seemed better than jail. <laughs> who says he can't go home again? It was, uh, so he goes to, to war and then he comes... Wow. Okay, cool. Chapter 1, The Old Country. Sicily, July 1943. Operation Husky. I was assigned to the 504th Parachute Infantry. On the 11th of July, we were supposed to be dropped over the southern coast of Sicily. But we got hit by flak and had to bail out. Way behind enemy lines. Only three of us made it. If it wasn't for the local resistance, we wouldn't have had a chance. So when Mussolini soldiers came into the town and started rounding everybody up, we decided to return to fate. 
Ah, ma è fuori. Se nessuno parla, quest'uomo morirà. Eh? No, 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 eh? per favore, no. No, no. Uh oh. All right, Scaletta. Take the shot. Allora, traditori. Pensavate di poterci prendere in giro? Uh oh. Almost died there. Your head out. Must have the prisoners upstairs. Clear the second floor. Scaletta, you take point. Alright, okay. Yo, where did you come from? That is so crazy. Dicevo al mio amico di stare attento. Fregatene di fare attenzione, fai ciò che ti è stato detto. Che 
diavolo sta dicendo? Chi si crede di essere? Un offerto da fare. Ma è più davvero Don Calò? Cacetto, un congè quando si ammaretà un mecucino. Ma chi è quello? Lo conoscete? Eh, lo conoscono tutti. Don Calò è un uomo d'onore. È uno stupido trucco degli americani, non ditemi che gli credete. No, è davvero Don Calò. Ogni tanto dovesse ascoltare i consigli di noi altri del posto. Ce ne andiamo. Sapete che potete affidarvi di me. Che ne dite, eh? Don Calò, the head of the Sicilian mob. An entire garrison of troops surrendered that day. Why? Because he told them to. Wow. So the beginning of the game is pretty cool so far. I'm actually enjoying it for the most part. <laughs> A few years later, the Nazis put a bullet in me. I was in the hospital for a bit. Then I got a month's leave so I could go home. At least for a little while. Vito! Over here! Joe! Hey! Welcome home, buddy. How'd you know? I got my sauces. Come on, let's take a ride. Nice car. Comes with the territory. I know you're itching to get home, but first, let's get a beer. Yeah, sure. Well, this is interesting. I like the old style, like, gameplay game, like, where it's like old, the old times with all the car, fancy old cars and stuff. There it is. Empire Bay. Tell the truth. You miss it? Hey, does a bear shit in the woods? Not like this place ever done me any favors, but anything's better than a foxhole. It's all this shitty weather. They're saying this is the coldest winter on record. Papers say it's gonna keep up like this for weeks. Don't worry though, a drink will warm you right up. To look behind How the long's it been since we had a drink together, Vito? Two years? And almost three. Only to Jelly's party, right? Come on, Press that Vito. button to Come switch on. the driver cam. The last drink we had together was right after you Well, that's neat. You can actually go in right that before you shipped out. You remember. Ah, oh, five minutes. We're already talking about my deadbeat father. Can we change the subject, please? So tell me, pal, what was it like over there anyway? I kept reading the papers to see what was going on. And you know how much I hate reading? Yeah, I know. You guys kicked Mussolini's ass, right? Ah, uh, sort of. We had a little help from a guy named Don Calo. No shit. Don Calo. I heard of him. Really? You bet. I know guys like him over here, wise guys. You work for them, you set. You fuck with them, you die. Nice to see you. This is what it looked like yeah. back in the old days. So metal, cool looking. Right? From old man That's himself. actually pretty cool. Oh, so you're a real war hero, huh? <laughs> and then what? You screwed a couple of Sicilian broads and came home? Yeah, right. <laughs> the old country. Over here, you can screw anything with a heartbeat. No one gives a shit. What a country. Here's to the US of A and to having you back home. Salud. Ah, salud. Chin down. How come you're back? They let you out early for good behavior? Nah, I took a bullet a couple months back, spent some time in the hospital, and now I'm on leave. Wait, wait, wait. You mean you gotta go back? Yeah, <laughs> what'd you think? The war ain't over yet. You don't want to go back, do you? Nah, of course not, but what can I do? One minute. Wait right here. Hey, Giuseppe. It's Joe. Remember uh, last week, you know, the guy, the guy's name is uh, Vito Scaletta. Thanks, Giuseppe. All right, I'll see you later. Okay, listen up. It appears that your injury is much more serious than it first appeared, and the doctors say you can't fight no more. What? Oh, whoa, whoa. did you just... Like I said, I know people. You get all the official paperwork tomorrow. When it comes to the right stamps and signatures, it's just a question of money. You're kidding me, right? <laughs> Isn't that a bit risky? It's me that could end up in a slammer, you know? And how am I going to pay for it? I got it covered. Think of it as a welcome home present. And don't worry, the documents oh my will God. be clean. I don't trust try. me. Well, 
Thanks. You're welcome. Como no frade, you're like a brother to me. Now you can start thinking about what you're gonna do next. Sure. But first, I gotta go home. All right, you wanna ride? No, thanks. I wanna walk around a little, see what's changed since I've been gone. No problem. Say hello to your sister for me. Come see me tomorrow. We got a lot to talk about. I can't believe you just got me out of the service. Thanks again. No problem. I'll catch up with you tomorrow. Hmm. <laughs> Some of the 36 taxi. Here we are. All right, thanks. Keep the change. Oh no. Copyright music. Oh no. Oh well, if I have to cup take that music out, it's like mu Christmas music, so yeah. What was this? I'll walk to my side. Ah, this is nice. You can walk. Oops, sorry. Kind of like in a rush to my house. I kind of stopped the music playing. This is definitely going to be copyright. <laughs> because of the music. Damn it. Oh, over this way. Wow. This is a dump. <laughs> Do I want to know what just happened up there? Jeez. Okay. And we're heading up, it seems. Alright, cool. Is this the door? Yep, that's the door. Hi, Mama. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> Vito, my boy. <laughs> my boy is home. I thought I'd never see you again. <laughs> Francesca and me, we wait. Hey, sis, what's going and on? We wait for you. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Sit down, sit down. You must be hungry, Vito. Francesca made you a special dinner. Zuppa di pollo. It's good for you. Wow, looks good, Frankie. It's a shame your papa didn't live to see me. He would be so proud, Vito. Yeah, sure. Vito, you know better. Sorry, Mama, sorry. Benice, signore, pronunciata, tutta la volontà. Stiamo provvedendo a quello che ci Per Cristo nostro Signore. Ah, so nice. Such a nice family gathering. You should get some sleep. Your room is just like you left it. Aw, thanks, Ma. You're so nice. I got a, such a great Ma. <laughs> Where's the door to get out of here? Wow. I'll see you two in the morning. Sleep well, mio bambino. If only I could speak some that. If only I could speak that language, I would like to know how to say that right. So what that means. Oh, in my box. This ain't gonna cut it. I gotta find a place to stay. <laughs> All right, let's take the leather jacket. So you have to go back soon? Actually, uh, looks like I won't. Uh, Joe's taking care of it for me. Joe, you want to get into trouble again? Mama, would you rather me go back and get shot again? No. Exactly. No. Joe probably saved my life. Promise that you won't get in any more trouble with that, Joe. You know, your papa used to work for this man at the waterfront named Papa Lardo. He's in the union. You could talk to him, work hard like you were your pup. Talk to him. Please, promise me you go talk to him today. Okay, Mama, okay, I promise. Grazie, Leo. Oh. Well, she's such a nice mother and he's going to be like, yeah, definitely going to do that for you, Ma. But, uh, it's 
gonna be kind of hard. That's the bathroom. Really tight in these bedrooms. Oh, okay. Gonna head out and go see if I can find the job. Gonna make some money, get some work. And... I don't give I'm a sorry. damn. I don't care we'll if you're gonna money. sell everything hey, I you got. What the hell's going on here? Vito! You mind your business, no. asshole. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh -oh. Come on, Junior. I'm gonna take you to school. Oh, tough guy, scaring a woman, huh? Come on, show me what you do. Vito, please, you're making it even worse. <laughs> stop, stop, please, Vito, what are you doing? Because he's hurting my sister. Die, you bitch. Ah, fuck this. Yeah, that's right. Get the fuck out of here. You're gonna be sorry. The both of you. What the hell was that all about? I'm sorry, Vito. We didn't want to bother you with this. Bother me? Bother me with what? Come on, tell me what's going on here, Frankie. Right before he died, Papa borrowed money. A lot of money from a loan shark. Thinking he'd get a better job and pay him back. We found out right after you left for the war. How much? Two thousand dollars. What? Shit. The worst thing is, this guy wants it all back by the end of this week. Otherwise, the debt goes up again. I ain't gonna make that kind of money working at the port. Who is this guy? I don't know. Mama won't tell me. It's okay, Vito. We'll manage somehow. Don't worry. I'll take care of this. I promise. Thanks, Vito. Take care of yourself. Aww. I gotta get my hands on two grand fast. I bet Joe could help me out. Uh-oh, Joe. He's gonna ask his friend Joe. They got him into going to... Okay, so tab this to see the map. All right. I guess we're gonna start. Whoa! I almost got hit by a car. All right, let's go talk to my friend Jew. Gotta be quick about this. Run! Run! Oh, I'm closer. It's just up over here. La la la. Yeah, 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 yeah. <coughs> Excuse me, ma'am. Uh, uh, do you know where Joe Barbro lives? To the right of the stairs. And tell him that racket last night has to stop. If he don't like it, he can find another place to live. Thank you so much. Hey, yes, man. <laughs> not at all. Come on in, let's talk. Uh, you disgusting pig. I picked up these broads on my way back from the store. I've been waiting. All right, girls, that's it for now. I got business. Stop by tomorrow, okay? We'll pick up where we left off. Chop, chop. Come on, Joey. Maybe it's stop where we can all have fun. The fun's over, baby. Later, I said. Me and Vito here haven't seen each other for a long time. We got a lot of catching Wow, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to, mount, I'm gonna have to block that out. Not bad. I tell you, that little Spanish broad is fucking wild. So how'd it go at home? Good. Mama wasn't thrilled when I mentioned your name, though. And you know how she is. She wants me to get a straight job. You're gonna look for one? I don't know. But I sure as hell ain't gonna make the same mistake my old man did. I gotta pay off his debts, then get back on my feet and get my own place. I need to make some real money. And punching the clock ain't gonna cut it. Hey, you can stay with me as long as you need to. And we'll find you a job where you can make good money without killing yourself, all right? Music to my ears. 
Right now, I'm living off the 20 bucks the state gives me every week. <laughs> I know lots of people who pay well for a risky job, so to speak. Huh. I'm sure I can line something up for my oldest friend. The working man's a sucker, that's for damn sure. You said it. Okay, step one. I gotta introduce you to Giuseppe so we can pick up them discharge papers. Let's go. Well, I guess we're gonna go, uh... You made enough cash for all this in the last three years? More like the last three months. I barely had time to furnish the place. Three months? Holy shit. You just gotta know the right people, and you're all set. Cause you know me. The best part is, we're gonna have to leave it over here, guys. Because we'll continue when we, uh... You know... Yeah, we'll continue. <laughs> in the next video. So later, guys. Bye-bye.